Hey everyone, welcome back to some more of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, last time I finished off this part in which basically we got Sigurd back to Ravenstop and yeah, for this video we're gonna continue on uh, from that point and we're gonna see what else the game has in store for us. So, let's go. Uh, hello controller. My controller is not working. There we go. Finally. Alright, my controller is working now. So, yeah, let's see. So, if you can see the quest menu, there's a few quests that we can do, possibly. Uh... I'm thinking of doing this one, Spiritual Defense. Alvis needs help protecting Ravenstop from evil spirits. We're gonna get some more legend tokens here, I'm guessing. Uh, so this is one of these Ostara Festival quests that's going on. So it says wait for nightfall, which I'm gonna do. While we do wait, uh, what have you let's just go around Ravenstop. Petra chasing a white elf in the woods high as wispy clouds, my god. I could barely breathe for laughing. Beautiful, beautiful. Nature is amazing. Iron Brazier scheme. I brought something for you. We always have need for this. Uh, can I deliver anything? Nope. All done. I have something that may interest you. Would I need Bringing though? me this would be helpful. Reindeer ant antlers, a lot of them. Lynx paw, hare foot, dog's fang, fox fur, fox fur, hare foot, dog fang. I'm looking for this. Hare's foot. I need to kill some hare. Animal guts, brown bear fur, black bear fur. I'd pay well for this. Raven feather, lynx paw. Polar bear fur, dog fang, hair on beak. I could really use this. Viper egg. Animal guts, viper egg. Arctic fox fur. Black bear raven. always have need for this. I think I can sell off some wolf claws, let's be honest. Nothing else? Yeah. I must take my leave. So long. Until next time. Now before going to Alvis, I still need to wait for nightfall. So what I'm gonna do is... I'm just gonna go around to this store. I need to talk to Yan Li. I wanna sell off a few creating things. What have you got for me today? You should buy that. Great room. A guardian team. Celtic mossy tombstone. Prisoner's tree, mossy tree. Small altar. Blooming statue. Let's Eivor, get that. Yes, this is a brilliant choice. Mimir scheme. Head, arms, front. Mjolnir sign scheme. This would suit you, I think. Aoki scheme. Mimir scheme. Done shopping for the day? If I have two in Mimir yes. scheme you on the tattoo, kid. I hope to see you soon. I'm gonna get the Mimir scheme. Full set. Hunter as well. Blooming statue.
Where do I put the brazier though? What would be a good place for the brazier? Stretch your wings sooner. I think Brazier should be next to the tree, but that statue looks really good there. With the team, I think the tree is fine, so I don't wanna change the tree until the Yule Festival is over, that is. Also, that should be the same for tattoos, so I'm not gonna change tattoos right now, I'm gonna just wait for nightfall. Alvis, not where the fuck is Alvis supposed to be? Cast about this land, there. my friend. Wait, that's Alvis, motherfucker. Spiritual defense, let's go. Ah, good. You're here. Where is all this? Yes, well, you see, all this and I got into a little argument. I may have made some disparaging remarks about his paranoid fears. <laughs> I don't imagine he took that well. No, he did not. He told me that if I was so sure that his fears were baseless, then I should perform the ritual in his stead. Have you ever done anything like this? Goodness, no. But he left a list. Anyway, how hard can it be? What does the list say? It says to start by lighting fires around the settlement to create a protective barrier against spirits. <laughs> Utter nonsense and a waste of time. Perhaps, but I would feel better honoring Alvis's wishes. Of course, of course. Go light the fires and then return to me. There are more steps on this list. Fire pits. Light the fire pits. All right. Good. <laughs> I see a fire pit over there. May this fire protect us. Hmm. What do you see, Sunan? Farm. I need your eyes, my friend. 
85. Alright, let's skip that part for now. Um, Survey the area soon. I have to go closer. That looks like a fire pit. This should burn brightly. Go, my eyes. One. I think I found one of the fire pits. There. There. The fire should last until morning. One fire pit down. In my eyes soon. I think this is better than the Guardian Sashu. Let's be honest. It goes with the team a little bit more. This looks to be the spot. So there are eight fire pits yeah. in total. The fire should last until morning. There. The fire should last until morning. Boiling with them. Hmm, I got distracted. It's fine.
that it? I have to go. See you soon. Until next we meet. One there. Where's the last one though? This should burn brightly. I need five more small bullheads. I want to see if I can like swap armors because that would be kind of fun, not gonna lie. like one left Fires have been lit. I should return to Arke. <gasps> All right, let's go back to him. Oh well, this was a simple enough video. Doesn't really do much. Shows you just around the Raven's Top area, region, whatever. It's kind of pretty, not gonna lie. And I feel like it's almost morning well so
ritual tree ornaments. I think this is what. Yeah. It's fine. Let the tree be here. Or maybe not. Oh well, we did it. Anyways, let's go back and return to our key and then see if he has another task for us or something. Okay, all the fires have been lit around Raven's Fort. Good. Now follow me. The next step takes place in the forest. You warriors are so worried about your spirits. Like today is any different than any other day. Be careful, Arke. That kind of thinking can leave you defenseless in the face of the unknown. Perhaps, or perhaps it leaves me more time to work on my craft and not spend so much time worrying. What does all this ask for this next step? We're to draw out any spirits that have crossed into our world and would do us harm and destroy them. And how will we find them? There will be a rune or war that has let them into our world. I assume we'll know it when we see it. Seems easy enough. And how do we banish the spirits? Hmm. Who doesn't say? Maybe we can talk to them? Otherwise, I've found a punch to be a reliable deterrent. Alvis says this ritual must be performed at night. We should wait until the sun has set. I'm here, Ake. Come, Eivor. Let's finish this foolish errand. Still in the spirits of foolish myth. Now is not the time for acknowledgments, Eivor. Is done. I can barely believe it. We both saw that, didn't we? Yes, RK. It would seem you're always an apology. I do. But I would never give him the satisfaction. 
It's back to the brewery for me. Oh my god. <laughs> One body festival tokens. Let's go man. Fuck champ. damage you still health on parry I mean this shield go this effect just definitely helps that low amount of health for each hit copies Increase melee damage after a dodge. That could work as well. Increase critical chance. Could even go for a spear, to be honest with you. Increase speed. Detonate a sleep bomb. Increase attack after a heavy finisher. Knocks enemies to ground. Increase heavy damage after each light hit. Increase attack after taking a hit. Blocking increases light damage. Increase stun after a heavy hit. Increase speed, increase speed. Increase attack. Increase ability damage. Ignite your weapon after critical hits. Like with this chance to ignite, I think this could go well. I, th I think best case scenario is to change this to the fucking spear or something. Right, so unfortunately guys, this will be ending the video. In the next one, I'm going to continue my journey of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I could go for a brand new armor set to increase level of one of these armor sets that I have. The unfinished ones. Um, Raven Clan clo Cloak is still... Uh, not upgraded. Let's go and upgrade the Raven's Clan cloak or whatever. Increase armor, lower your health as additional increase to critical chance. Yeah, let's go for that. And then we'll see. With that said, I will see you in the next one. Bye.